Kuz Tarshiv is Misha Bara, August is Misha Os Ardarta, so Kunta Kiri, August Akhavi in Koni, a Bala Ahakria, and Ish. So, uh, my name is Barry, and uh, I'm from originally from uh, just near Artfert. Uh, uh, from County Kerry, and but now I'm living in Dublin, um, and uh, I'm going to play a few. I'm going to play another another tune. I'm going to play. Uh, I'm trying to practice my Irish as well, but that's another slow project. Um, but, uh, we, we'll take a crack at it at some stage. So uh, I'm going to try a tune called uh, Willie Coleman's Jig. Again, I'm just after opening up a, a book of tunes that I used to play a long, long time ago that I probably would have got from my childhood. And some of the tunes now I haven't played. They're well-known tunes, uh, great tunes. But I wouldn't have played them in a long, long time. And uh, I tend to try them on the fiddle as well, for sure. I try them when we play them on concertina. So this is Willie Coleman's jig. <laughs> Willie Coleman's jig, and again, haven't played that in a long, long time. A bit ropey, uh, but uh, one shouldn't never worry about um, uh, about uh, uh, making mistakes. Just kind of uh, play through them, modify them, vary it. Um, um, it's again, the, the, uh, it's it's a nice, nice, handy uh, tune, uh, and I haven't played it in a long, long time. A lovely tune, well known tune, and notes are widely available on the. The, the internet, so it's Willie Coleman's jig. So we play very slowly now. So uh, a few ornaments you can try. Uh, ornaments on the B, B D B. Um, an ornament on the E, uh, high E, which uh, high E F E. Ornament on the high A, which is high A, uh, high C, and back to A again. Um, you can 
double note uh, as well. So like uh, played. Something like that. Uh, again, um, up to your own uh, musical taste. You can probably use the bellows. out of that but uh, effectively just using the bellows to accentuate the, the rhythm so So you can uh, put in pauses uh, to accentuate out the, the rhythm as well. So space between the notes. Uh, you can lentil notes, lentil notes as well. Like. So again, you can lengthen notes, uh, put pauses between the notes, double off the playing, uh, grace notes. So uh, grace notes, uh, uh, jigs, uh, I've been playing a lot of uh, grace notes in the B. B, B, D, B. D, A, D. Cuts on the high A, which is uh, A, high C, A on the high A. On the second part, <coughs> um, ornament on the high E, which is uh, uh, E high A back to F sharp and E again. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, uh, ornaments of the high G. Uh, have a bit of a cough, uh, a cold. Uh, it's not COVID. I had a, I had my COVID test and it came, thankfully it came back uh, negative, fully vaccinated. But uh, I have picked up a cold, so excuse me on that. <coughs> excuse me. playing uh, can make it uh, interesting to the ear as well so there's loads of little tricks you can use uh, um, and then it's just about uh, using them in the tune so uh, um, what I've got like on the second part the ornamentation I'm using the uh, uh, grace notes in the high G uh, which is G B high B G again cuts on the high A which is high A uh, high C high A Ornament on the high E, which is uh, actually I'm using uh, an ornament of uh, an E, uh, tipping the F natural and back to F sharp, back to E again. And again, try and make the ornaments sound as subtle as possible. So uh, 
for making the, an ornament, you don't make, make the, the embe embellishment uh, molds uh, very strong at all. You keep them very, very subtle. So again, very nice tune. Uh, simple enough tune, um, but you can put in a lot of uh, pauses, long notes, uh, use the bellows uh, to accentuate rhythms, and then using grace notes, uh, double octave playing, um, and uh, uh, cuts. And then, but but the tune itself is the most important. All the embellishments and ornamentation is there is just to ex accentuate the, the 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 tune and make it more interesting for the the listener. So, just gonna play it normally now, and then uh, Shin and Will that will be. And that'll be finished. That'll be it. Uh, uh, that'll be that'll be the finish of it. So Willie Coleman's jig. Attempt at that tune, so uh, should I will. And again, when you're learning the tune, relax, um, try and enjoy playing. It's uh, very much a, a hobby, or, or uh, so effectively, uh, you're doing something just to change uh, your normal uh, sense of the day. Uh, and music is a great way to, to do that and to do something different. Um, so Willie Coleman's jig, uh, well-known tune, uh, well available on the. Notes are well available on the internet and uh, uh, should and will. Uh, don't be afraid to make uh, mistakes during the tune and uh, experiment.